Right, okay. Ah. I was going to use that for my dash cam, but I haven't got a mount for it, so I can't. And I can't be bothered to go back indoors. Anyway, it's um, it's getting rather autumnal now. Uh, today is oh, is it about the 20, 23rd today? I think August. Um, twenty twenty. We're rapidly running out. Um. Anyway, time is um, uh, a quarter to six. Um, and I'm off. On my way out to pick up a friend of mine uh, wants me to take him down to the airport and um, I'm doing it as a favour actually because I owe him a, a couple of favours and this this is one of them um, so yeah I'm taking him down to the airport um, he's off to I'm well, not sure where he's going actually I'll find out later but but anyway um, not an awful lot happening over the past few days, hence uh, not too many sort of videos of sort of appearing on my channel. Um, have been playing a bit of golf, um, sort of enjoying the exercise really, just sort of the walking around the, the golf course or what I call the countryside. Um, golf isn't too bad to be fair, um, but I just really enjoy being out there. You know, in the fresh air and sort of having having the freedom, um, and that's really nice. I really do like that. And you get to meet an awful lot of nice people as well. I've met several groups of um, of people who want me to go and join them, um, which I might do. I'm I'm not ultra competitive, not anymore anyway. I don't really want to go down that route of um, you know. Of, going in entering too many competitions and things like that I mean I haven't got a handicap at the moment um, and I'm not really bothered if I get one or not I just like to be out there and smack the ball around a little bit and um, get some exercise and breathe some fresh air that's uh, that's enough for me to be honest that is enough for me right 25 past 7 on the way down, I was in the middle lane doing about 75 miles an hour and there was this pigeon <laughs> or let's just say there was this pigeon yeah anyway he's probably in bits about it now um, anyway done no damage to my car thankfully but I've just checked but I did uh, I did smack it at quite a speed uh, right okay uh, 25 past 7 mm -hmm. um, I think I'm going to get myself. Oh, yeah, I will uh, get myself uh, hot chocolate. I think McDonald's is around the corner. Um, I've not had one since. God, goodness me! Right, March, April, May, June, July, August. Six months. That's half a year. My God, I've been, I've been doing nothing out of work for basically half a bloody year. Uh, thank God the wife's working, eh? Um, yeah, it's a lot of it's a lot of money to lose, you know, being self-employed half a year. Uh, what's this guy going? Well, I want to get in that lane, and I reckon this guy in the red car wants to come in my lane. Perhaps not. Uh, yeah, anyway, yeah, I'm going to nip around to uh, Mackie D's and um, as long as there's no massive queue, by the way, uh, get myself um, a hot chocolate, please. Is that everything? Uh, yeah, yes, please. Thank you, next thing now. Okay, cheers, thanks. Yeah, it's only 99p. It was 149 once upon a time. It's probably only a small one, I expect. Morning. How are you? All right. There you go, my darling. Oh, that's good. Not very busy then. Not very busy. No. Quiet. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, thank you. Oh, here we go. Look. 
That's what you call service. Well, that was quick. Thank That's great. You. Cheers. Thanks. Yeah. Take care. Thank you. Yeehaw. My first hot chocolate, guys. Okay, this is like since. Yeah, March. My goodness me, has it really been that long? You're joking, aren't you? It seems like, you know, summer has just like, hasn't happened. Oh, oh, I'm just hoping we're gonna get a nice few weeks would be nice, wouldn't it? Because uh, winter's long and dark and cold and miserable and oh, I just wanna go and kill myself. Oh. Perhaps I shouldn't joke about that actually. Killing yourself because um, I think the crap which we've got coming uh, in the next few months uh, with a whole lockdown situation, loss of jobs, loss of income, uh, mental issues, I think there's gonna be a lot of people who are really gonna be struggling with that. You know, I don't make, I don't make light of it you know um, it's a very real and a very serious situation um, there's gonna be a lot of people in a lot of bad situations um, in the coming months and uh, each and every person for himself I think just got to try and get on with it try and get through it um, until uh, better days to come hopefully Right, uh, we've just uh, just got home. Uh, time is um, what is the time? A uh, quarter to nine. Um, this is the reason why I don't like gorilla glue, gorilla glue, because it's just well, I I just think it's rubbish. Um, this is my GoPro five, which I've been using, um, and uh, it's come off. The glue just isn't strong enough. I've got to go out and get some. Um, uh, some better glue, some super glue or something. Just, this stuff just isn't man enough for the job. That on there. Right, that hopefully should do the twick. Uh -huh. Right, doesn't need an awful lot of super glue. This stuff is going to be better, I'd have thought. It, it's a lot quicker as what well. Bonds a lot quicker. Gorilla glue takes like oh quite a long time to bond. This ought to bond uh, literally within ten seconds or so. There we go. It's done already. Look. Make sure it's square and straight. That'll do. That'll do. And then what I tend to do there is just kind of. Um, just fold that down slightly. And there we go, people. There we go. A um, few things on my mind. Uh, obviously, work or the lack of it. Uh, my sister in law's brother, Andrew. Um, is in a real bad way at the moment um, he's on a ventilator um, it's not covid related although they might put it down to that at some point anyway I th what we think happened there was uh, he may have had a stroke morning <laughs> and um, we think he then collapsed and banged his head badly uh, put him into a coma, and I think he's been there for about the past five days. Um, they took him out, I believe, then they put him back in again uh, because there were some issues going on. And um, they tried to take him off, I think it was yesterday, but he wasn't breathing by himself. Um, and that's not good. That is not good at all. Uh, so really, it's down to the doctors now what they say whether to keep him going uh, hope that he survives or turn the machine off that's the two choices really uh, I mean as if Mandy hasn't been through enough this year you know with a with a whole episode of her operation on her heart I mean thank God she came through that 
you know, only to be faced with this. Uh, yeah, you know, it's, it's, it's struggled that family. They really have. Anyway, thoughts and prayers uh, go out um, to them. It, it just, it really does take the shine off uh, off the day when, uh, you know, when you start to think about this kind of stuff, you know. Right, I'm just going to change the settings on my um, Osmo. Let's shoot in 4K, 30 frames a second. We try that. It's such it's so simple to do that with this thing. Right, so 4K at um, 30 frames per second on rock steady. Right, here we go. Here we go. Filming it now, so there might be a slight difference uh, in quality. So what we do, we do this, then we go back and do it again in 1080p. And then I'll shoot down there. There we go. That's uh, where we were, where basically we're going to be heading. So let's head on back uh, to here. Well, a bit further actually. Right. So this is 4K on rock steady at 30 frames per second. Right. We go back to this tree. And what we're going to do now? We're going to turn it off. There we go, so that was a 4K bit. Let's go back and do 1080p at 60 frames per second. And we do exactly the same thing again. And then we'll see what the quality is like. There's much difference in it. Right, here we go, here we go. Uh, 1080p, 60 frames per second, which is what I normally shoot at, which is good enough for, for YouTube, for, for what I do anyway. And we're going to stop here, we're going to look down there. And uh, there, there you go. Was well, there any difference in it, I wonder? I don't know. I won't know until I get home and put it on my PC. We'll walk back here again. So just do exactly the same as what we did before. Yeah, just a bit of a test, just to see uh, what the quality is like. Now, sometimes the issue I get is that my computer can't handle the file size because there's a lot of information goes into 4K. That's one of the reasons why I shoot on 1080p at 60 frames per second, is my computer, which is quite old now, it can't handle it and it crashes sometimes. Um, so I'm kind of hoping that um, that it doesn't. Anyway, this is quite nice. So I'll just what I'll do is carry on down here for a little bit longer. Uh, this is still 1080p, 60 frames per second. Right, I'm going to stop it now. Flick it over to 4K. at 30 frames per second again we're just testing the camera out um, see what uh, the quality is like um, hopefully it's looking pretty good yeah. it's a good camera I do like the quality of it it's it's quite a lot heavier um, than the GoPro not heavier 
Um, I think, you know, when you go for something like a, a GoPro um, and one of these, so no doubt there's one or two more out there, you know, you can, uh, in the marketplace, I don't think there's a huge amount of difference uh, in the quality of the results. Um, but I do think when it comes to GoPro, because they were the first in the market of small cameras, action cameras, I really do think that you're paying a bit of a uh, a price tag for the name. I know it's the same with cars, it's the same with golf equipment, you know, it's the same with many things. Uh, really, you are you are paying for the name, you know, but the product itself um, is probably very similar, I'd have thought. Uh, anyway, without this video being dragged into 20 minutes or more, I think what I'll do now is just end it here. Uh, say thank you for watching. Um, I will continue with my day. I'll probably go up the golf course and I might take my cameras with me and have a bit of a frolic around. I might do, but that's not going to be in this video. That will probably, if I do do that, I'll stick that in another video. The old dog's all the way back there. Look. Um, I took him up the golf course yesterday. He was absolutely knackered. He's a Rottweiler. You can talk. <laughs> How are you? Hang on. Hang on a minute. How are you then, Joe? Are you alright? So make sure. I thought old Peter Wasp name would have been going back by now. Yeah, I'd have thought that. Perhaps he's using somebody else. Perhaps you're perhaps you're taking him. Right, you're not taking you're not talking about you're not you're stealing my customers and not telling me. No, I ain't you taking bastard. anybody anywhere. Bastards. Yeah. <laughs> How you done today? Any good? Um well I normally come out between about twenty past five. Right. And uh, like a Saturday and Sunday, by dinner time I've done a hundred quid. And I go home at dinner time. Yesterday I came out at quarter past five. And I seem to be running one to the other, to the other, to the other. And I thought, <laughs> nine o'clock, I've done 70 quid. That's all right. Then it fucking went dead. I didn't do nothing for an hour and a half. So I went home. Shit, man, that's no good, is it? Come out this morning. I got a bloke in, in Leiden that wants to go to the railway station at six o'clock every morning. So I thought, well, I might as well stay in bed till half five instead of getting up at five. And I got a job straight away to the station. And I'll start from the station. Yeah. Didn't work very well so it's, oh, right. it's not very it's not been very busy no, yeah. i've done 50 quid but that's okay. with that that's with that bloke's money in that 850. yeah so much is all cash almost on the count no i don't want a count job today so. mm. one five pound 80 job today so i've done 52 10 today okay and i've got to go and put some money in the bank today because my I had a text from the bank this morning saying if I ain't got any money in my bank by two o'clock, I'm going to be charged. Uh, Over, overdraft. Yeah. Oh, well, not overdraft. Uh, bank charges. Banks, yeah, overdraft. Yeah. Yeah. Bastards. So I got to start oh, paying yeah. my jag now again. Oh yeah. Yeah, because oh. I've had a three-month break on it, but now they've got to pay it again. It's due tomorrow. Shit. So it's eight hundred and twenty quid. Whoa, Jerry. Yeah. You had you had much work of your own. No, not really.